Lighting in my kitchen right now is crazy bright because it's sun is setting, but guys, I did it. I'm like super impressed with myself. You can see it fully here. Um, yeah, like it's not like obviously like symmetrically perfect everywhere. But I'm kind of okay with it because it gives it more like the hand done like henna kind of vibe. And so I really like it. And I'm pretty impressed with myself. I can't believe this actually worked out. So I just used white acrylic paint and then just a small little paintbrush and just, like I said, I sketched the design first and then I did like some freehand stuff uh, out in the outer edges. But I'm super happy with this. So good DIY. Uh, I'm tired, guys. Ah, stupid string. Today was a long day. It is Monday evening and today, so Monday's like my Saturdays, guys. Um, because I actually don't work on Mondays, like I said earlier, and, and so it's my day to sleep in and get caught up on life. And so anyways, today I actually um, went to a class at BYU to learn a little bit more about Final Cut Pro, the editing system, that was cool. And then I had to go take some pictures for Sexy Modest, that really cool store I was telling you guys about, and actually I'm wearing the, a shirt from them right now. I'll show you. This is my outfit every day. You probably saw it on my Instagram if you follow me at just Jesse. And uh, this is a shirt from them. I showed you guys um, last week when I unboxed it. And this is the coral tee from them, just crew neck, super cute. I paired it with these striped pants, and then I had these sandals with it. And then I also had, oh, wait for it, I had these like pretty tassel coral earrings and so yeah these are from Amazon guys these are like a dollar and then yeah my shirts from sexy modest um there's a link down below to buy it and it comes in a ton of other colors as well super cute and then my pants are from Vegas like I've said a million and ten times I kind of like my hair too I was trying something new today you know and then my my gold stripey sandal things so yeah that was my outfit today guys and a little spiel of what happened and then I just got done filming my video for this week guys it's gonna be super funny um so go check it out because it'll already be up by the time you see this vlog it is Mormon reacts to the South Park episode about Mormons so yeah go check it out guys we're going to a birthday party <laughs> A friend of mine, actually my sister-in-law's brother, is having a birthday party with a bunch of his friends. <laughs> and um, anyways, Eric's with me, because he's home, I'm so excited. Hey. Anyways, um, I have a dress on, this is from uh, Macy's originally, if you guys know the brand American Rag, super cute, and then just some sandals, and yeah, anyways. This is so, from Walmart, I'm really excited, because I'm, I'm excited, there's not, you got that Italy big liar, I have an Italian flag on it. <laughs> Mexican. I'm really excited because there's gonna be cake, guys. Oh my gosh, you guys, I am dying right now. So I just got done filming a video. Um, today is ooh Thursday evening. And um, I'm trying to get a week ahead on my videos because I'm going to be traveling here um, in another week or so. So I don't want to like struggle to edit and film like obviously when I'm on vacation. So anyways, I just got done filming a sister missionary video, which I'm super excited about. It will be what is in my, or well, I guess what was in my sister missionary bag. So super helpful for all you girls who are getting ready to serve. And anyways, um, I had to turn my air conditioner off so I could film so like there wasn't a background noise. And oh my gosh, I'm sweating so bad. <laughs> so anyways, I'm on my way to um, a uh, business meeting slash uh, dinner casual thing with my husband tonight over at BYU. So this is what I'm wearing. I have this top. This is actually from Wet Seal, you guys, literally from like when I was in high school. Um, I never wear it, but today I pulled it out because it matched. Um, these pants I actually got on my mission in Peru. Um, I love patterned pants, you guys. If you know anything about me, you know that I love me some patterned pants. And then my little gold slide sandals. And um, then I have some tassel earrings. These are also from Amazon, you guys. And then my little hair bun thing. I'm kind of liking this. And uh, yeah, that is my outfit. I feel like these pants make me look kind of hippie. But uh, like you know, like extra hip area. But whatever, we're going with it. So, <laughs> hey guys, it is Friday afternoon, and I just woke up from a nap. Oh, that's bright. Uh, there we go. Um, I just woke up from a nap, and uh, oh, I have a really funny secret to show you guys. Okay, so um, we're not allowed to have pets in the apartments that um, we live in, and our neighbors that live down like two doors, they were gone for the week, and they have a fish, and so. 
I don't know if that's against the rules or not. But anyways, they asked us to watch their fish. So we've watched their fish, Gil, for the last week. But actually our landlord had to come to our house today and like check up on the furnace and everything. And so I had to hide poor Gil. Now guys, Gil is a fish, but look where I had to hide the poor little guy. Gil, are you okay? Gil? You, you alive in there? I feel bad. He just had to sit in the dark cabinet. So we're gonna get Gil out of his hiding place now. And yeah, I'm working on a video for you guys. I just got an editing one. Oh wow, that's really close. <sighs> Okay, I just got done editing a video um, for next Wednesday, uh, well for this Wednesday by the time you guys watch this, um, it's a super good video like I said, and then for Sister Missionaries, and then I'm working on another Sister Missionary one, because guys I feel like I'm doing so many just like, like Mormon for the public videos, like, you know, all these like Mormon misconceptions, and like the South Park one I did last week, and it's just bringing like a whole different type of people that like I kind of don't want on my channel, because they leave like, really nasty things. Not that that bugs me, it really doesn't, because you guys write the sweetest things, so it totally makes up for it in the long run. But anyways, um, I really want to get back to just doing sister missionary videos and helping my girls out, and because that's just what I feel best doing. So anyways, I have another um, exciting one that I'm going to film today, and yeah, remember to leave all of your video requests in the comments down below. So yeah, and I also forgot to mention, um, a, uh, one of the girls did not respond to the giveaway, and so I had to, um, pick another, uh, giveaway winner, and I already picked her. Her name is Michaela, I'm pretty sure I have her picture right here. Anyways, I already contacted her, and she won as well, so congrats to her, and, um, congrats to all of you girls that won, and like I said, I'm hoping to have another giveaway. Um, it'll probably be at a larger number, like 5,000 maybe, just because we're about to hit 1,000, you guys, and so, woohoo! <laughs> Alright, so, um, that is pretty much all that's going on today. Oh my gosh, I forgot actually one really big thing! Guys, I've been home from my mission for a year today. A year ago today, I came home. That's crazy. So, anyways, to celebrate, my husband and I are going out to Peruvian food tonight. Um, so I'm really excited. Honestly, I'm not the biggest Peruvian food lover. Um, <laughs> That sounds terrible, but I just ate so much of it for a year and a half, and like they're really prideful about their food. Uh, but anyways, they like I feel like I honestly just ate chicken, rice, and potatoes. Anyone who has served in Peru, you totally get what I'm saying. Chicken, rice, and potatoes, the holy trinity. <laughs> but honestly, so that's, I'm, I'm not like the biggest Peruvian food fan, so this will be the only the second time I've ate Peruvian food since I got off my mission. But anyways, it'll still be a really fun time, and I can't believe I've been home for a year. That's so crazy. <laughs> All right, it is dinner time, and I'm excited. We're going, like I said earlier, we're going to Peruvian food, and so I got my Peruvian style on. You could say um, I have this dress that is that actually I got on my mission. Um, I thought it'd be really cute, like beach dress. Obviously, I don't wear it on my mission. Holy crap, no. Um, but yeah, this is super fun. And then I have um, my gold sandals on, and then I wore these really fun little Peruvian earrings um, that actually a convert gave me. This little bead right here is like actually a seed that falls off of a tree, and then um, it like has like apparently like a lot of good luck and like health stuff. Anyways, so that was really fun. And so we are headed to dinner now. If someone ever gets ready, I'm always the first one ready, guys. Okay, so we've got some Taidin and Salados, and this is super good, and then Inca Cola, my favorite. Eric's actually not allowed to have Inca Cola because Eric gets too hyper when he is, has Inca Cola. So he got maracuya juice. So, anyways, how was it? Good. That's really, really good. Okay. Hey guys, so we're at this Peruvian restaurant right now, and Jennifer just came up to me. She's actually from Peru, yeah. but she knew me from my YouTube channel. So that's super cool. So, uh, where are you? Wait, so you're from Remac, right? Yeah. Okay, so she's from Remac, Peru. And how long have you been here in Utah? Like, four months. Four months. Four months. Okay, yeah. cool. Well, it was so fun meeting you. Thanks so much. Hello. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Bye. Well, this is our last moments together. Your parents have came to get you. Oh my god. Oh, bye. Yeah. We'll see you next time. You're fine. You can come play anytime you want. <laughs> <laughs> if you ever need anything, you know where to go. We're gonna go swimming, guys. We're going swimming. <laughs> I was dying and I had a really bad headache today. And I didn't feel like doing anything, but swimming sounds nice. We're going swimming. Oh, wow, this lighting is just beautiful. Anyways, we're at the pool right now, and it just feels so nice to relax, you guys. I feel like I've been stressed all week. And anyways, Eric is over here swimming some laps.
Closer. Closer. Wave him down. <laughs> He's not coming fast enough. We have an ice cream truck that passes by, but we've never actually got ice cream from it. And now we have no sweets in the house, and I'm making dinner, and we need sweets. <laughs> we need sweets for dinner? We do! <laughs> Put some ice cream For there. after dinner, yes! Don't you go to the other side? <laughs> I know. Sometimes I call him dad just because it's like our joke between us. Um, obviously, he's, he's not my dad. <laughs> but he's just sometimes, sometimes he acts like a dad, you know? <laughs> I love you. All right, guys, that is it for this week's vlog. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And um, yeah, I got to see a couple more fun things that we are up to. Ah, oh, it's so bright. <laughs> and. Um, Anyways, I feel like vlogging is really fun and obviously you guys are liking it. These videos are getting lots of views and um, anyway, so you guys can get to know me a little bit more and uh, just feel more like I'm just your friend. <laughs> Sometimes like I feel like I'm super awkward in front of the camera, but like luckily vlogging has made it like a little bit less awkward, I feel like. And so um, something I want to do in the future before I end this video um, is I want to ask you guys to leave your questions down below in the comments. So like, oh gosh, I'm out of breath. <laughs> but um, I want to do a Q&A video in the future. So that way, like I said, you guys can get to know me a little bit more. And um, so leave your questions down below for a Q&A and I will start collecting those. And so we can make a whole video about it so we can just be best internet friends. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for watching. Bye.